Hello, good morning everybody. It is October 25th. Nice uh, sunny yet cool morning here in Toronto. Glad you got up this morning to join me. We're going to do some life drawing. I've changed it up a bit again. I am doing a lot of experimenting with time. I know a lot of people have asked for quicker warm up sessions. I'm actually going to do a uh, maybe a five minute uh, warm up session where we just draw circles and lines and really warm up that arm. So that's probably an activity um, I usually do, uh, but I haven't had the time because I'm just calling this so close, but it's probably something I'll set up. Or we'll just do some line work and circles just to warm up that arm and then get right into the figure drawing. But other than that, I hope everybody is okay. I hope you're enjoying your uh, your fall, wherever you're joining us from. If you're in chat, uh, please introduce yourself. Um, people are uploading some really cool work. Uh, not only the Discord post of the day on the Discord server, but they're also uh, uploading their original artwork. And I see some traditional media, some oil and acrylic, which is pretty incredible, inspirational. So I encourage everybody to uh, get up on the Discord server and um, introduce yourself and upload your artwork and see and compare and contrast and uh, get to see other people and get inspired. So that's always good. It's a nice forum. I, I like the Discord, uh, Discord app. It does great work that way. Okay. Uh, let us begin. Uh, the timeline you're looking at is going to be uh, four or five minute poses for today. Uh, two 10 minute poses and then a 20 minute pose, which will be the Discord pose of the day. So it will wrap up in an hour. These sessions will become longer. I am aiming towards two hours. Um, I struggle with concentration. You know, I couldn't draw for more than 30, 40 minutes. I feel after doing this for a year and I hope everybody kind of gets some inspiration from it. Um, if you are struggling in that aspect, that I can go probably close to two and a half hours now uh, with highly concentrated drawing. So um, drawing itself uh, or the art of rendering, the art of synthesizing images and then transforming them through your arm onto the paper, that is a muscle that needs to be worked out. Uh, you just don't do it. Professional artists do draw for six to eight hours, but that is something they've um, honed in and developed. Uh, over a lifetime so it is difficult um, for for super concentration I believe um, several notable psychologists have said uh, usually the human brain can only concentrate and synthesize information for up to 40 minutes or in sessions of 40 minutes so that's interesting probably should do some research on that in terms of how it applies to art but I believe art and writing poetry sculpting they're all the same so they all probably uh, fall within the same framework in terms of how much information we can gather. Okay, enough of that little sidetrack. Uh, let's begin here. Uh, I know I'm forgetting something, but it's okay. We'll do it as we're drawing. Uh, we'll shut that off. Here we go. The first pose of the day, five minutes on the clock. I'm going to turn up my music a bit. I will do some talking while we're drawing, not too much. Surprisingly, my throat is pretty clear today, so it won't be too much coughing or hacking or throat clearing. I might speak too soon. I'm going to zoom her in a bit just for you folks. There we go. That's nice. Okay, five minutes on the clock. Have fun, everybody. Let's begin. Once again, I am always... Uh, being the amateur I am, I am always fooling around with brushes, so it will be interesting how this works out. Let's see. be a little too thick but that's why I'm gonna stick with it I'll reduce it after
Definitely messed up on the chest there. It's way too long. More like there. It has a slight elevation to it. Okay, not bad. Not bad for the first pose. Not gonna complain. Let's restart. Five minutes on the clock. Flip this back. And the next pose. Five minutes on the clock. Let's begin. I did notice when I was... Um, randomly selecting the poses today. I did a lot of uh, standing up poses. I just noticed that after, you know, copy pasting it all, but... It happens uh, very subconsciously, trust me. <laughs> I feel like this is...
already tell I've got maybe a little too much too much with the um forest area, but we'll see how it comes out. I feel there is a bit of the energy captured in the bows, but um I don't wanna I'm just trying to get it all within the Yeah, that's too far out. Maybe like there. It doesn't feel right. Yeah, that's it. That back leg gave me problems. Um, that would be his left leg, the foreshortening there. Ah, I feel like it was too low. It should have been like around here somewhere. Or maybe this leg is too short. Like there. That would have been, I think that would have fixed it. So that gap is what I was trying to fix. Oh well, okay. Let's pose. Five minutes on the clock. I will move it. I guess that's one good thing about manually using this clock is I can just move it freely. Okay, a lot of foreshortening. This should be a little fun. Five minutes on the clock, have fun everybody. With these five minute poses, it just feels like we're eating time. It's uh, interesting. I'm gonna draw the full head and figure out the foreshortening after. Huh? There's this little spinal... That spinal indentation is a really good... really good um, tool to use when you're making proportions. Don't be too hard, hard on yourself, folks, with that. Uh, with this pose. It's a difficult pose. Especially for a stretch. You notice I'm almost rendering what's behind the muscles and then worrying about the front. I don't want to spend too much time on the arm. Like I said, we only got four minutes, but if you can capture the rough shape of it, I think you're in good shape. And I can already tell I screwed up a couple of places. got the year right on but everything else like you see the arm should be connecting with the hair so I've completely messed that up well, his nose comes down like this with his face and then there's the hair shape that hair in a bit and another arm Oof. dynamic indeed folks Go with the leg. I'll come back to the arm. If some area frustrates you, you can always come back. where things get tricky with that calf muscle.
only a minute left, folks. Oof, man. The struggle is real here. Okay, okay, it's coming together. bigger but I'm not gonna adjust it we only got 12 seconds left a little messy I'll take it um, a little messy but I'll take it let's do it okay five minutes on the clock this is gonna hit the 20 minute mark Jeez Louise, we are killing time here. You know what uh, is already throwing me off? The direction of this pose. Um, I think most of the characters thus far, sorry, the models, have been um, facing left, he is facing right. Anybody notice that? Okay. I'm literally talking to myself. Let's do this. Don't worry, you don't need to type in Twitch. I know you guys are concentrating on your drawings. As you should be. I think I'm off in a couple of places, but we'll see. Ouch. Do this. This mouth. His nose and his eyes. I feel his head probably needs to be way, way larger. Yeah. That's okay. How are we gonna fix it is the big question. So we're gonna. We're gonna enlarge it on the back end. I think that'll make our life easier. Yeah. There we go. That mass of the head really needed to come through, I think. Um, not that it's gonna to matter too much on a five minute gesture, but it's just training your body to get it right. Okay. I'm going to go and do a line right through everything, just so it kind of helps me capture that energy. Here we go. I've drawn them way too large for the canvas. Let's resize. If you're watching this and you think you have the answer to this question or a theory, when I'm drawing on a paper on a traditional medium, I don't have this canvas problem. It's like my brain automatically knows to render within the paper, whether it be 8.5 by 11 or 10 by 17. When I'm drawing digitally, it throws me off a bit. That makes sense. Anyways, wonder if you guys suffer from the same dilemma if you're switching over to um... this already is off. I follow the curve. I follow the curve. That should be to the tip. Let's try that again. I don't know, it didn't feel right to me, so I'm gonna redo it.
I do that? Hmm? No idea. I think the head is once again off. It needs to be much bigger. If I had time, I would just go in and, you know what, let's do it quick and see if it makes a difference. Right. Oh. Something like that, maybe. That's a quick uh, cheater's way of doing things. Oh. Sorry about that. That should be locked, folks. Why am I? I definitely feel like the head could have been a little kind of like that. Like that. Okay, I'm cheating. I should stop. That's it. Uh, he's he's way more forward. Sorry, I'm going to just deviate before you guys draw in. I'm wondering if he made the same mistake. He was He's going this direction. When he kind of should be going at an angle and kind of like this direction, if that makes sense. He needs to be coming more forward here, like this. I don't know, what do you guys think? I feel the energy didn't have him leaning forward enough. And that's kind of where line weight and everything kind of comes in. Okay. Next pose is... I forgot, it's going to be a 10 minute pose. We're going to do two 10 minute poses. Give me a second here, rest your arms, give it a little stretch. And then we'll follow up with the uh, 20 minute Discord post of the day. 10 minutes on the clock. I'm gonna say take your time with this one, but don't take your time with this one because we burn through five minutes. 10 minutes is gonna be even more dangerous. Here we go. Five, 10 minutes on the clock. What do we have? Oh, very nice. Okay. Did I cover the feet? You guys wanna see the feet? I'm sure you do. I'll put it right here. 10 minutes on the clock, let's go. Excuse the, uh, excuse the slurping of water in the background here. Yeah, that works. I'm 
drawn like it's a 30 minute pose. I mean, I'm just taking my lumen time with this thing, which I shouldn't be. Okay. Come on head, where are you? There we go. Come on brain. Did that right, folks. Okay, I think I kind of got the pose there, the energy of it. That arms was oof, arms and fingers very difficult here, very difficult. This is a 20 minute pose, I would um, mostly like come back and re render that. I'm not happy with the the energy of it. Okay. I'll be the first to admit his um his head is a weird shape, so Please take that into account. Not the worst, not the best. See, I, I already have to redo the chest because it's so off. I'm still not happy with this. I don't know why. That um, that was a big mistake.
minutes left, folks. Two minutes left. Two minutes. Excuse the noise. I'm bringing the mic a little closer to myself. Y'all can do it. Come on. Get the full render in. time on there. Not bad. I think I, I really fudged up the uh, legs there. I too much time on the torso. I did get a bit of the energy in the torso. Um, oh, sorry about that. Uh, I reset that clock here. I'm just going to show real quick. I'm looking at my canvas next to the larger image, just like you guys are. And I felt like here, he should have been a little more, a little more energy that way. What do you think? And, uh, the leg should have come down a little more like this. A little more like that. Down more. Anyways, okay. That's what I love about digital. I mean, uh, I can just quickly give myself a quick lesson by contrasting the image over. Okay. 10 minutes. I believe this is the sixth pose of the day. Yep. Ten minutes on the clock. Have fun. Um, much harder than the last pose, so. Uh, you're allowed to take your anger out at me. A lot of layering and foreshadowing going on. Foreshortening. Foreshadowing is a literary thing. Spending so much time on the head. Don't ask me, folks. I mean, in some essence, it's helping me. Um, it's kind of helping me. I understand a hand does go over it, but I'm not gonna render that just yet. I'm getting the uh, clavicle. I'm way too large with the uh, render so far. I can tell you already, I'm gonna resize it. Like the knee comes up right there. Oh. 
I don't know if this is working. Um, I don't know. Is this working? Let's see. Mm, it looks like it might work. I might be able to actually pull off this pose. I thought it was going to be a complete disaster. Trust me, folks, I surprise myself sometimes when I'm doing these drawings. Shrink. There we go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When you resize it, sometimes it actually helps you kind of get things back in proportion here. I think maybe there the arm doesn't feel doesn't feel oh natural there we go i'm gonna use a smaller brush if i get time because i wouldn't be doing it justice using this brush or the fingers so i will leave it be might have to be larger let's see you can kind of that Ooh, that is a weird shaped foot yeah we're definitely we definitely messed up some stuff here so we're gonna fix it It's weird, the calf is being compressed uh, outward, so it's bigger than it regularly is. And I think, I think you folks agree with me, it's throwing everything off here.
Could have made an executive decision there and um, finish the legs. I chose not to. I chose to just add some uh, depth, I guess you could say it. But yeah, uh, tricky pose. I apologize if you're new and you're watching this and you're trying to get this down. Uh, very difficult, but uh, um, I didn't know where to start, but it turned out okay. I mean, it's recognizable, but I always don't have high expectations when I go into uh, these type of... Uh, poses because they're very um multi-layered very difficult um we are 40 minutes in no oh, 50 minutes if you include the preload uh so we're gonna spend the next 20 minutes on the discord pose of the day give me two seconds here stretch your fingers folks we will begin the final pose 20 minutes Welcome to begin. I'm going to start this in just a second here. I'm going to set it up on my end. Okay, folks, Discord post today. Please encourage you to get it up on the Discord server. We'd love to see a render of this version. Um, and cost, uh, contrast and compare everybody's uh, different uh, files. So, 20 minutes has started. Um, if you need Discord information, it is on the about page. Uh, now, you came off an incredibly difficult pose to one that's a little less difficult, but nevertheless still difficult, so. Uh, and you got an extra 10 minutes to render it, so. Hopefully you can do it. Might be going too large, but we'll see. How are we gonna do this? 
Too many lines, too many lines. There we go. Uh, yeah, something like that. That still feels off. Maybe, okay. giving me such a hard time.
Okay, what? Jeez, okay, time flew there. That was 20 minutes. So, uh. Wow, that went fast. Um. I thought that went like light speed. Or maybe I was just getting into a flow and. I, um. I just got caught up in it. I'm gonna do like a minute or two of shading here. And then I'm gonna upload it on the Discord post. I think the head, once again, I have small head syndrome. Probably needs to be a little bigger like that. Anyways, uh, well, it was a tricky pose. I mean, we did harder poses, but um, in terms of detail-wise, I feel proportion-wise, I was kind of getting there, but oh well. Give me a second here, folks. Just going to reset the stuff here. Hope you guys had a great day. Um, thanks for watching. I'll be back Friday morning, 11 a.m. Thanks for getting up in the early, making an effort to draw. Um, please upload your image on the Discord uh, server of ours. The information is on the About page. Other than that, hopefully you guys had a positive drawing session and you're happy with the... You're like me with some of the work, uh, depending where you are on your art journey. Um, a lot of it is getting up in the morning and just forcing yourself to draw. And drawing in the morning specifically, because we know... We know through evidence and science that um, the brain is uh, most uh, the best to absorb information. I'm sure there's a scientific word for it that I don't have at the top of my head, but uh, the best time to learn, basically. So thanks for joining me, everybody. I will see you later.